It's a new dawn. It's a new day. And in 24 hours, I could be a dad. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome you face back to vlog where my name is Tom and I film every single weekday of my life and post it on the internet for your faces. Now, I've been doing this vlogging malarkey for a very long time to the point that I have documented on camera the behind the scenes of when I built this very house. And at that period of time, I always intended this just to be the ultimate man cave where I had beer pumps, bars and battle stations. But all these years later, this house is finally fulfilling its purpose and becoming a home. And if you couldn't tell, I'm pretty damn excited. I've been counting month after month, week after week, day after day, counting down until the 24th of October to when this baby is supposed to be joining us. And I've got to be honest, my girlfriend is supposed to be giving birth tomorrow and she's showing no signs whatsoever of him either popping out tomorrow, the day after, the day after that, the week after that. She's so casually relaxed and pregnant, it is Unreal. So it looks like we're going into pregnancy over time. So make sure you click that subscribe button, ding dong that crab, and leave a comment down below of when you think baby Jellyman is going to arrive. My guess, knowing me and my family, is going to be a whopping two weeks late. I'm calling it right here, right now. He is going to go the distance. He is going to be two weeks late, and he is going to make us so stressed, so angry, so worried, that I'm going to end up looking like that. Bruh. But when he's ready, he's ready. We've got the birthing room set up. Everything is good in the hood. We've got the hospital emergency bag. Just in case we've got to go there. And I guess now it's all about playing the waiting game. And yes, I am inside the birthing pool. Good look at it. So much room for activities. Now, there's a reason why I'm sat in the hot tub. And that's because I have actually got so much time to kill. You wouldn't think that with a baby on the way. There's probably a lot I should do. But um, Lydia has popped out just to go and do some last minute shopping with a best friend. And she said, Tom, we've got a very important parcel on the way today. Um, don't miss it. So I've got the gates wide open. I've got a sticky note on the door saying, I'm in, knock loudly. And I'm basically not allowed to go anywhere until it arrives. So welcome to an absolutely riveting day in the life of Tom. Hey, there you are. Look who's back. Hello. Going out again. Pregnant Joe. Hi, hey, Jenny. Right. Aw. <sighs> Due days tomorrow. Yeah. No signs. No. <laughs> when do you think Jellyman's arriving? I'm putting the first into the world. The first? Yeah. Right. Flipping hecka. Lydia's brought me supplies and snacks because we cannot miss this parcel that's coming. So I'm now chilling at home with a plain hand sandwich and some mint. Cocktail sausages. Now, best friend Jenny, when do you think Jellyman's going to arrive? I to You're number one as well. Uh, number one. Do you know what it is? I'd like him to come down so would I. Yeah. 1 11 23. I'm going to his birthday. Oh! I've been now sat in the house since 11 a.m. and it is currently half past five waiting for this package. And I kid you not, in between the time I've been waiting, Lydia has managed to go out once, come back, go out, and come back again. I'm so sorry. They, I'm really cross with them. The game was a one-hour time. I was under very strict instructions to not miss this package. To the point where I've basically been on house arrest and it's still nowhere to be seen. Cracking vlog this. Well, something's just knocked on the door in the forms of... Da, 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 da. Oh, it's you. And yes, the car is fixed. Stop thought Mercedes fixed it. But you have to come into the house because... Dun, 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 dun. Oh, look at that. Proud Tom Stiles, proud of Oh, is it what all you ready think? to go? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it's cute, isn't it? Oh, don't stop, you're breathing. Natural reaction, the baby comes out. Oh, this is so cute. You like it? Yeah. Like you think I did, we did a good job? Well. Yes! <laughs> now, the reason Alice is here is not to see the birthing room. It's actually to finally pick the winner of the Summer Rain £2,000 holiday giveaway. Just keep pushing. Do you like that? I did that one. I and I drew that. that. Yeah. And what's that from? Yeah, Adventure is out there. What's it from? Is that up? Yeah, that's up. Aww. It's a good vibe, isn't it? Aww. And I bought a ladies bar. The blue one that was provided wasn't really the feng shui. Feng shui. But, no, no, no. The reason why it's like this is this will regulate the temperature of the water. Yeah. 
There's a function for everything. Hey, you're here to pick the winner of the giveaway. Oh, Stay oh, away from our jelly cats. Stay away from anyone. our jelly cats. Oh, now, Alice, these ones over here oh, have been oh, sent in for you and Arla. Look at them. We've got little sushis. <laughs> this is a big chameleon. That was for Alice. And then this is a fat lion. <laughs> oh, honestly, you guys are so kind. Alice, you've even got a grumpy turtle. Oh, let's see. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Lydia! There's a DP Divan outside. Yes! Oh my gosh, I have wasted an entire day waiting for this delivery. Go on there, boy! I finally got it! I got it! I'm free! I'm free! I'm free to do whatever I want to do with the rest of the day! I can't believe it! I'm free! There's your package! Do what you want with it. I'd love to say I'm going off doing like some adventurous stuff today, but I actually don't have anything planned. I was just going to go out for a bit of a drive and go down to Syndicate Regional to see Alice, but Hi. she's here. Came to you. I just wanted to say thank you so much to everybody that sent things for Arlo. And Alice. also the people that didn't send it for Arlo, but Tom and Lydia have kindly gifted to Arlo. I can't <laughs> wait to see his reaction on, the, on that, especially this one. It's lovely. But no, thank you so much. It's so How many do you think you've got now? I should have counted them, shouldn't I? My Instagram yesterday was like... Did you saw the picture? <laughs> Put it on screen now. The picture was, it was pretty. Now, whilst I'm making my sister a cup of tea, these two seem to be spilling the tea about all things pregnancy. Don't worry, I'm not going to film this because this conversation sounds very in-depth. So that's my cue to leave and sit minding my own business until Alice is ready to see the nursery. Are you ready for the big reveal now? Oh, yeah. Come on. <laughs> Welcome to Jellyman's new home. Oh! Oh my days! Look at this! How nice is this? And you did you manage to get your foot shelves up? Ken. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, it's been in it. <laughs> and don't worry, we've already got jelly cats everywhere. Jelly cats up there. No jelly cats up there. No and jelly cats in here. So technically, yeah. this time tomorrow, on paper. Oh. We should have a baby in our arms. It's nice with the ambience, isn't it? It's only what I could sleep in. Do you know what? I agree. Because the next thing she's going to be doing is wanting to decorate the bedroom. Oh, no. <laughs> Look at you. Did you say before you're getting broody? I can be, yeah. Oh, she wants another baby, do it. I'm saying I've got, I've got one of these size zero nappies, size one nappies of like Arlo's. And I can't bring myself to throw it away. Like, it's just one and it's like as if you used to be that small. Oh, I know the tiny. Look at it, put it in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's just a baby. 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 It's just a yeah, birds tweeting. A television static, white noise. <laughs> but then listen, listen to this one, an actual washing machine. I want a baby that Wait. Baby that <laughs> That's brilliant. Oh. Wait, is this lullabies? Oh, oh, oh that's dear. lovely. Oh, Ready to pick a winner? Let's make oh, you're about to cry. I was crying. <laughs> Come here. I'm proud of you. I was just said, well done to me. I just looked at the and was like, uh, no, My well done to her. Is, did we buy this? Yeah, that, that, that yeah. singing thing with all the noises. I was like, this is Mickey bought this. And she's like, all, we, all, did. All, we, we did. We <laughs> did. All right, let's take a seat, Alice. It's time to pick a winner, winner. Yeah, what is this? Before we pick a winner, I've got something <laughs> pleasant for you. What have you got? And your caps. Oh! Oh, hat number one is black and white. So we've had these ones for a while, but they're now obviously being restocked. They sold out like hot cakes last time. Ooh. These are our new caps. We've got grey and white. We've got white and black. Boo. Boo. Sorry, but I always... Cream and white. Boo. Oh, yeah, cream and white. Boo. Cream and white. Boo. Boo. People liked it, so we, we made it for you. And the, and the best. The best hat that won the competition, Team Cream and Black, yes! Yeah, so since like we literally couldn't decide, oh. we were at Lockerheads with it, we decided to do both. Oh. So you'll be able to buy black and white, grey and white, white and black, sand and white, and sand and black.
Great success! Just gonna go for a close up on these bad boys. Looking clean, looking fresh, looking nice! Well played. But okay, the family has assembled at the table. Can I, can I just make a point why you know we're wearing a summer in t shirt? <gasps> Why aren't we wearing a summer rain t-shirt in this lovely summery weather? Shout out to every single person who's been repping and just having the time of their lives making fun of me. That's all it's been. There's been people stood out in rainstorms. There's been people with hose pipes above them. Um, and I'd just like to say thank you very much for supporting Syndicate Original. It's been incredible to see the hype and the support. But hopefully, with who we're going to pick now, you guys are going to be able to go off somewhere amazing and enjoy a lovely holiday. Like we said, it is a £2,000 holiday. I hope, I hope that the winner chooses to go to, like, Lapland. Oh, it's summer. Yeah, and it's wear a summer rain t-shirt. That'd like, be good. That, that would be really good. In the depths of, like, winter somewhere. And I'm just throwing this out here right now because I did say this before we actually, like, finish the sales of the shirts we will be doing a photo shoot competition yeah. for all the people who have the summer rain collection and that's going to go from uh, people doing like funny pictures professional photos everything so don't worry if you're not some like pro with it, some epic camera it's going to be across the board and some people i already know i'm going to hook up with some swag who've sent us some funny videos yeah. so and can i say if you didn't manage to get the summer rain t-shirt during the pre-order event they are going on general sale on wednesday yes and we listened to all of your customer feedback and we are sorry that we didn't have a size bigger than 2xl in the sand and the sky blue so for general sale you can now get up to size 3xl in sand and in sky blue as well and the black goes to 5xl explosion explosion but all right i have the ability to press this button right now to pick so nice. the winner when i pick it it's going to pick the order number of which alice is going to check to make sure the person has like followed all the rules and everything like that and will then crown you the winner of the Syndicate Original Summer Rain Holiday Giveaway. Yeah. So thanks for bearing with us. Yeah. It's been, it's been chaos. It's been we, lost, we lost our house for an entire two weeks. And three. Three, and then you guys finally got your shirt. So are you guys ready? In yeah. three, two, one. And the winner is, are you ready? Summer Rain Sky Blue. So Ooh, congratulations. Yeah. Thank you so much for your support. We'll You're be in absolutely touch. absolutely amazing. And we will be in touch. Yeah. <laughs> Should we ring them? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we can. Yes, there's a number. <laughs> All right. Please answer. Hello, is it Amber? It is, yeah. Hi, right there. It's um, Tom, and I'm just ringing you to let you know that you've won the £2,000 holiday. All the orders to win the holiday giveaway. Oh my god. <laughs> Honestly, just wanted to say like a massive thank you for the support at Syndicate Original. You know, family run business and everything, but you have indeed out of everyone bagged it and we just want to say congratulations a million times over. Thank you so much. Where, where are you thinking of going? We're getting married in 2025. No! That's, That's a, wait, we make it sound like a bad thing there. We're like, no, oh, that's amazing! <laughs> So is that going to go towards the... What are you going to do with it? Uh, Disney. Yes! Oh my oh gosh! Oh my god, it's perfect. That is absolutely amazing. We want to do Universal as well, so you can go towards one of them. Oh, uh, congratulations! Oh my gosh, I feel a little bit sick. I'm like, literally crying! <laughs> oh, Amber, congratulations. Like, honestly, thank you so much. Like, I, um, um, we're, we're sorry um, it was not as sunny in England, but hopefully... At Disney, it will be way sunnier and you can send us some pictures of you wrapping a shirt. Definitely. Oh, amazing. Well, Alice will be getting in touch to get all the details sorted out with you and we'll be sorting you out with your prize. Perfect. Thank you so much. Oh, you're amazing. Yay! Congratulations. Congratulations. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Yay.
and going to Disney. That actually couldn't be any more perfect. Yes! Oh, I just can't wait. <laughs> Another uh, a water's drop. Yes! <laughs> Oh yeah! <laughs> I can't believe it! Yes! I cannot believe that! I cannot believe they answered! Oh! Congratulations! Oh, I'm so happy! I am I'm so so happy! In yeah, I'm invested as well. But I, I know th invested. this has to go without saying. Like, thank you to every single one of you guys who has supported Syndicate Original. It's the family-run company. You've seen it. I, I say this a million times over. I don't take a penny out of this company. It's all going back into. I've not even said anything about what I'm wearing here. It all goes back into Travel making bigger Bund. and better <laughs> things. All right. But honestly, just thank you to every single person because there were so many of you picked up the shirt, repping everywhere, and more so. Thanks to Alice and Mum for letting me have creative control on how to do this giveaway. We've got. So much more cool stuff planned down the works, and we're going to be doing plenty more like this. So stay tuned, and honestly, thank you. You're legends. And you know what? A well done needs to be said to you. Thank you. You got it all done. Me you were too. cracking the whip on the troops in the oh, basement. Yeah. You had Lydia's sister working for you, and you smashed it. You smashed it. Summer rain. Summer rain. In That's winter. <laughs> wow, straight into summer. <laughs> oh, did you say Christmas jumpers? Did you say Christmas jumpers and uh, potential giveaways? Oh, 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 you'll have to see. <laughs> see you later, Santa. You never know, this time tomorrow, <laughs> I might be telling you to come around and say hello to a baby. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I will. Love you, Alice. Take care. Oh, brilliant. You've got to love it when a vlog comes together. <laughs> and you've got to love it even more when I have a vlog go out exactly on time. Look at this. Released exactly on the dot. Oh, happy days. If only Joey was so punctual. <laughs> Well, don't get getting late. Don't get it from his father. I'm on time for everything. Every day. I swear. <laughs> no, hang on a second. Someone's trying to break into my ass. What are you doing? Oh, are you alright? I wasn't expecting multiple guests. Surprise! Come here. Nice to see you. I'm not in the hey. anymore. It's gonna be auntie. Auntie, auntie Sue. Auntie. I can't believe it. Yeah, grandma. Yeah, grandma. We're placing bets now. How long do we reckon until he's actually here? I think it's 1st of November. Oh, you first 1st of November as well? Mm -hmm. That's actually Vicky's mum's birthday. So it would be lovely if it actually ended up being the first. Plus, the 1st of the 11th, 23. Sick. <laughs> Whoa, she comes with gifts. A table runner. Is this Christmassy? Or just in general, because it looks very nice. A table runner. Lydia also then got <laughs> an egg cup, like you do. And whoa! Syndicate original model. Work it. Work it. Wow. Catwalk walk. Uh, wow, dodging all those sun rays. Cindy, I don't even know if they're out yet. <laughs> Gotta love the improv. <laughs> Slay. Which one's your favourite? This one. No! The white. The cream with. I like that a lot. I actually really like Tom. the white um, embroidery. Really? I prefer yeah, this one, me. What is it? <gasps> That's lovely! Oh, Look what a lovely surprise! Would you like a cup of tea, Vic? On, yeah. This day's doing a 180. It's the day, it's the day oh. that stuff is getting done. I, I like it. Great success. I was, get, I was getting that vlog FOMO. You know what I mean? Like where I vlog and not much happens in the day. And I'm like, uh, bad vlog. But hopefully this is turning it around. I'm going to give you a bit of a behind the scenes B. Come with me. So what what do you call these pieces of paper? Well, you said it. Aff affirmations. Affirmations, yeah. yeah. Got to know the real reason we've got pieces of paper on the wall. Did you need to cover something up? <laughs> What did you have to cover up? Ta da! <laughs> oh god! Oh no! <laughs> so it's a mystery game me. as to which one's got a hole behind it. Here's me. Like, why Why have you got those stuck on the wall? I'm like, so baby comes into a loving yeah. environment. No, yeah, that's what we've turned it into. But it's actually yeah. to patch the holes. We're just wondering which one we're going to put on the ceiling. <laughs> and B has made one. So when Lydia's in here going, hey! She can look up to the ceiling and see it says You look great from this angle. <laughs> that is great! That's a really good one. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. And Vicky's doing one as well. Oh, yeah. Be bold, be strong, banish fear and doubt. Joshua 1 9. <laughs> so sweet! And there we go. It has a place on the wall. We should have got Alice to do one. Alice was crying looking at these ones. She saw that one and she thought of Grandad. Now, before I carry on with the rest of the night, can I give you guys a massive shout out? The new vlog is absolutely banging. One out of ten. They People like seem I to like love it. it when you're productive. Productive to. 
I know what you say. I just, that's bait. You're only saying that because I've got to build the new bed. Yeah. Any volunteers? Auntie? <laughs> Grandma? I'm the fun auntie. She don't build bed. Bye bye now! <laughs> And would you look at this? Pregnito is in building mode. I told you I would do it. I dropped a screw and I can't find it. Well, now I can't do it because you bloody broke it. Are you saying you've got a screw loose? Yeah. It's actually not. It's a bolt that I've dropped. You could say it's bolted. <laughs> Get yourself a woman who does it all. You go, Pregnito. Thank you. You go. Are you happy I found the bolt? Yeah. Do you want me to take over the rest of it? No, I'm alright, I think. I'll tell you when I'm struggling. <laughs> like now, because that screw's going nowhere. <laughs> Would you like me to step in yet? I just don't understand this bit. <laughs> She's so stunned looking at the instructions, like, why is this not working? But this one goes all the way through. Have you done it backwards, babe? No, imagine. <laughs> I'm just going to put this uh, bolt down that she dropped and step away from the danger zone. <laughs> Good luck. You can do it. And if by magic... Oh, look, it's now my job. <sighs> A swift unassembly from Lydia's put together because it was a little... It was a little bit janky, babe. Just... Just a tad. But it's done. We now have a new little baby. What do you call it? The cot? Cot? Crib? Bed. Oh no, but I call it a job well done. We now have a cot in the lounge. Oh, that matches perfectly. It's really good, isn't it? Flipping out. Yeah. Like, really close. Smashing. Yeah, I'll stick to what I'm good at. Oh, oh. <laughs> no, I was, I was just smelling it. What is it? Oh, yes! Lydia's made bangers and mash, but not just any bangers. These are the ones that we got from the farm shop. And I'm, I'm just, I'm very excited to try them, to be honest. Whoa. Tomato and sausage. Mmm. Oh, wow. That's really good. And then this is just the normal farm shop one. And the survey shit. Mmm. Mm, very nice. But it'll be much better with some grave. Dinner was... Honestly, delicious. We've been sat at the table watching yesterday's vlog back. I can't believe it was an hour and six minutes long, but Lydia had the suggestion of... <laughs> so that's our plan. We don't have a TV on the wall, but we do indeed have the projector. So from the window to the wall. And I can't believe I'm actually even contemplating saying this, but all these late nights are finally catching up with me. It's been like, what? The last three nights back to back, it was like three o'clock in the morning, half past two in the morning, one o'clock in the morning, and like it's finally caught up to me because I just fell asleep watching the rest of that vlog. I was so enjoy it, but so comfy on, on the sofa, and then I just fell asleep and just woke up. YouTube's turned off, and uh, we're going getting in bed, and it is only half past ten at night. <laughs> was I snoring? No, you were so cute. Oh, I was so comfy, honestly. Do you know, that's my favourite way to fall asleep when I'm just, like, when I shouldn't sleep, but I'm just like, I'll just rest my eyes for a second. I'm it's my favourite way to fall asleep. sleep. you in bed, I just left you. Oh no, my phone's about to stop. Bat I've got 1% battery. Yeah, it turns out my battery was very low, and I've woken up with extreme bedhead. But I've woken up fancying a snack in the form. <laughs> Wait, what? These look like strawberry pop-tarts. I could have swore I picked chocolate. Wait, I have, I have, I have dripping balls. I've, I've, <laughs> you like when you nap? I, I can sleep, like, for eight hours straight, wake up, and it feels like a new day. I sleep for 20 minutes, right? I feel like I'm woken up on a different planet. I have no idea where I am, what day it is, or what world it's going to be. To which I'm questioning, what what is life going to be like with a child? I don't function without a solid amount of sleep as it is like, just for full clarification. This vlog you've seen me in today, I've been holding it on by fine threads. Because I've been so tired. Honestly, I can't express how tired I was because... All last night I was just constantly up because I kept feeling like Lydia moving around or, you know, like making noises, like, ah, in pain. And I just thought the baby was coming, so I just couldn't settle. So let alone the fact that that's now. 
what am I going to do when the baby's here? And I'm constantly thinking, like, is the baby okay? Do you know what I mean? Or is the baby constantly going to be keeping me awake, crying or pooping or needing feeding? Do you know what I mean? It's like, I'm just, I just, I have no idea what human I am going to become. If I don't get my eight hours sleep, I'm a little bitch. And I know I'm going to have to completely adapt to be like, right, you just nap whenever you can, you sleep whenever you can, you know, just to tick on by. And everyone says you just go into this like autopilot mode of you get up, you feed them, you, do, 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 you look after yourself, you sleep, you wake up, you do that. And you just like rinse and repeat. And there's just no routine. It's just all over the place. But I just know I am a grumpy gills if I don't get my full eight hours sleep. I'm, I've got to admit, I'm, I'm really nervous for this next step of life. Not because it's like, oh, I don't get my full amount of sleep. It's more than anything that I can be a really cranky, moody bastard if I don't get some sleep. And the one person I don't want to get the brunt of the force is Lydia. Because when I'm tired, obviously, you know, she's the one who's going to have to deal with that. Just like when she's hangry, I have to deal with that. So I make sure she's fed. When it comes to the whole sleep thing, it's like, there is no helping with that. If I just get a bad night's sleep, I get a bad night's sleep. So, mm pretty scared to be honest about that, that fact but oh saved by the dessert don't mind if i do and you know i'm having a glass of milk with it as well yes i'm 30 years old not <laughs> 13 wow do you know what this is reminding me of uh when i used to stay over at my grandma and granddad's every friday night uh when i was a little kid before i went to bed i used to have a uh, strawberry pop tart and a glass of milk <laughs> Not much changes, eh? Not much changes. Cheers. Oh, full milk for the win. If you drink anything else other than blue milk, you're a freak. Speaking of milk drinkers, where is he? This is now the next day. This is the 24th. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? I made this house too much of a home. Oh, the vlog's gonna be triggered. I've probably said that 98 times today, but he is showing no signs of popping out. I am filming this at like one o'clock in the afternoon, so there's still time. Ladies and gentlemen, this is judgment day. This is the deciding day as to whether all these measurements and time scales and everything and the 5% chance of a baby popping out on the due day is gonna happen. This might be the last time you see me as not quite yet a daddy and not quite yet a mummy. Look at us. Do we look like we're ready for a little child? <laughs> <laughs> so that was a bit close listen i need to outro this video but my mind is completely racing non-stop that at any moment it could pop out scary times are ahead folks scary times are ahead i just want to say a massive thank you to all the love all the support all the messages every day now that it goes on every hour basically family and friends and messages being like any baby yet any baby yet my twitter's bombarded with it my or x my instagram's bombarded with it comments bombarded with it you guys will know that there's a baby here when even one that there, there isn't a vlog uploaded on the day and you're like what the heck does this mean what i think it means and or if i post something on social media like as a little teaser but i'm not going to spoil anything i'm not going to spoil anything but the countdown is on i'm loving you guys i'm loving you guys and i will hopefully See you tomorrow for the next weekday vlog. And if I don't, you may know what that means. And if I don't, if I do see you tomorrow, you may know what that means because the baby might be here. I don't know what we're going to do. We're just going to go with the flow, but I'm going to go. So thanks for watching. Much love to your faces. And adios.